Hi YouTube, I'm back today to tell you all about the uh, the Galaxy Note 3 from Samsung. Uh, this is the Verizon uh, model and uh, as you can see I've opened the box um, in case you want to know. Um, you have your traditional look here um, for the box as you would have for any other uh, Samsung device. I mean the Galaxy S4 Active looks the same. The GS4 may look the same. Uh, my sister got one, but uh, I didn't see the original wrapping. But it's a it's a soy ink uh, box, uh, so very environmentally friendly, of course. Uh, very nicely crafted. Um, and so this is the Note 3, uh, but this is the Verizon version. Uh, it just came out two days ago, and so we want to take a look at uh, what you can look forward to as a Verizon customer if you're getting this. Um, on a contract or buying it off contract or whatever uh, this is what you can look forward to um, in your in your box as well as the phone now we're not going to get to the phone right now uh, but we're going to go through what's in the box first so that you're aware of what you're going to get um, in your packaging so first it's going to be a little packet here that says get to know your phone um, and of course these are kind of bound up um, and packaging so I mean you can basically remove the packaging here uh, there's a neat little place on the back that will allow us to do that break the seal it's probably best to do that you can get into the device uh, manuals and that sort of thing um, so the first one is get to know your phone all right and that's gonna have as you can see a bunch of diagrams um, replacing the back cover, removing the back cover, uh, or just some of them, charging the phone, how do you charge it, and so forth. Uh, that's going to be a little handy tool. Um, of course, this is in Spanish, it looks like. Um, I've done a little Spanish in my lifetime that looks Spanish. Uh, product safety and warranty information um, on your device so that you will know uh, what your warranty covers and what it does not cover. I would suggest getting insurance by way of Verizon um, in case something happens to your phone. I'm not really a big fan of company warranties and most people don't read the fine print. I would say get an insurance policy with Verizon, 10 bucks or so a month, uh, consumer information, um, which this looks to be, I don't know what language it is, but in any case, uh, if you want to read through that, Consumer information about radio frequency emissions and responsible driving um, probably has a lot to do with environmental health, um, your health in general, uh, with the frequency emissions um, and responsible driving, probably not having music turn up too loud, texting, be careful, don't text uh, and drive, that, that's a good message in today's society because people have died due to texting and driving. Uh, on behalf of other folks so global support calling card uh, this is a calling card number um, which is interesting I didn't realize that we had this um, yeah it's interesting um, it's a global support information and calling card uh, section on how to have your phone perform well overseas and that sort of thing. And so you may end up having a GSM device. Um, okay, so notice that it says in here, connect to a mobile network abroad. Verizon Wireless offers services outside of the US on both CDMA and GSM networks to access global networks while traveling abroad power on your device um, and then it says it gives you more information on features and things for that information uh, things of that sort so you might want to check into that uh, if you're a traveler I'm not much of a traveler I'm a traveling woman so that doesn't really apply but in any case here we go so we take off this first section here, we lift that, and now of course comes the goods of the um, adapters and so forth. We have our brand new USB 3.0. Now, 
this is straight out of the wrapper. Take a look at that thing. That's massive. It's bigger than any USB cable that I have to date. Uh, we're going to open it so you can get a look at that. It is taking a while to open, so just be patient. Um, they have it very securely uh, tightened so that you can't just pry it off right away. Okay, we're back. And again, take a look at this charger. This is probably one of the biggest chargers that I've ever seen for a Samsung device. Um, and I haven't owned very many, okay? I've only owned the Galaxy S3, the S4 Active, and now the Note 3. So I haven't owned that many. And this is the first Note uh, device that I've owned from Samsung. But this is a pretty heavy duty charger. I'll look at those ports. Now to show you how different it is, I'll show you a current USB adapter that I use with my Galaxy S4 Active. As you'll notice, I've got the two here side by side and take a look at those the one on the left is the current adapter that I use for the Galaxy S4 and the S3 uh, the one to your right is the Note 3 so as you can see there's a major difference between these two uh, the Note 3's adapter or USB charging port a USB cable that is looks a bit bigger um, it actually is faster. Um, the official word from Samsung is that it's going to give you faster upload download speeds. Um, and it's also going to charge your device faster. That's the official word. Uh, I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't undergone, I haven't subjected you know, 3 to any tests yet. So don't hold me to that. But that is what Samsung says it's supposed to do. Um, so as you can see, very different uh, charging cable for the Note 3. So... Samsung has tried to really kind of bump up the series and get official with that. And so that's the cable that you have to look forward to. With that out of the way, we can move on. Now we can go ahead and go through the rest of what's in the box. So let's take a look at what else we've got here. Let's see. Okay, we've got... Now this is the wall adapter. Okay, so we kind of know what this is. Yeah, so this is the wall adapter. So you plug it in the wall. Uh, of course, it's got Samsung's name on it. We don't need to kind of open it. Uh, yes, yeah, so you can see, put the USB right in there, and you should be able to operate that. So what else do we have in here? I think for now, that's about it. Um, I'm trying to think, what are these to be used for? I uh, don't quite know at the moment. Um, I'll make sense of those later. Right now I don't know what that's used for. That's a new one. I haven't seen that. Now we're going to show you the phone. What I mean by that is you're about to feast your eyes on the Galaxy Note 3. Uh, many of you for the first time. This is the Verizon version. Okay, so I mean, you know, Samsung only put out one Galaxy Note 3 model, uh, at least for now. But of course, uh, it's across uh, a few carriers, and so you may have already had a peek at it on other carriers, but not actually had a peek at it uh, from Verizon. So this is the official Verizon version of the Galaxy Note 3. Here it is. 
Yes, this is the Galaxy Note 3, as you can see by the button. And the major change that you're going to love is this back. Now take a look at the back. Look at the sides. You've got your stylus there. And you even have your Galaxy Note 3 on the back. And of course the Verizon 4G LTE branding. Where will we be without that? Um, now you also have the leather back plate. Um, I don't know if you can see this. But um, in the light you can see the side here. Uh, it just looks really nice, and it feels really nice to hold uh, in the hand. Um, you have your 13 megapixel camera there and your flash. Of course, you've got your top. You've got your bottom with the stylus, and of course, look at the size of the port uh, to charge via USB. As I said, it's pretty massive, but this is a this just gives the phone a very premium look and feel. Uh, it looks like a great device to hold. Um, and it really does feel great in the hands. Um, it's a 5.7 inch display. It comes with 3 gigs of RAM. It also comes with 1080p video recording, uh, full HD Super AMOLED display, a 1920 by 1080 resolution. Uh, it comes with 32 gigs of storage right out of the box. Now with Verizon, you're only going to pay $299 for this, so you're getting the 32 gig version. I don't know if they're going to sell the 64 or not. Uh, so right now, all that's available is the 32 gig version. But of course, it is gorgeous. And we're going to cut the screen on so you can see what it looks like. This is what the screen looks like at this point. Uh, it says Verizon at the bottom. And of course, it's got a gorgeous screen here. Um, there, there are quite a few wallpapers that you can add. But this is the official unveiling of the Verizon Galaxy Note 3. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please put them in the comment section below. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will be back to show you what you can do with your Galaxy Note 3. Bye-bye.